You don't think it should switch every day? What's the point of the festivities? Uh, the Attorney General has subpoenaed me for uh, their investigation. Uh, they're investigating me for the unauthorized practice of law. Uh, they claim their authority for the investigation is the Consumer Protection Act. So uh, basically, you know, they're protecting all of my alleged clients from me telling them that I'm a lawyer when I'm not. Uh, which is funny because I've never told anyone I was a lawyer and um, good luck to them. <laughs> Now, uh, there's, there's a New Hampshire law, isn't there, that, uh, that says you don't need right, to be a lawyer? R right. RSA 3111 says that any person can be represented by any other person of good character. Um, the two people I have actually represented in court, the judge approved my representation. So, you know, if there was a problem, the judge probably shouldn't have approved it. Uh, and. You know, um, none of the people have, you know, any type of impression that I'm a lawyer. They all know that I'm not and wanted me specifically because I was not a member of the good old boy club called the Bar Association. So do you have any theories about how they're correlating these issues? <clears throat> My thought is that um, about two weeks ago, uh, I helped some friends charge the town clerk of Grafton with official oppression and um, at the time there was uh, we uh, were giving the criminal complaints to a state trooper and the state trooper asks me so what are you their ringleader and I said no I'm sort of like their lawyer and so I'm guessing that this is where they're deriving this complaint from is me telling the state trooper that I'm a lawyer although that's not my exact quote and thankfully there was video recording at the time so I can show them that that was not my exact quote good luck to them <laughs> so should be fun <laughs> hello Okay. What's your business here, sir? I think there's some injustice going on here. Uh, I think the people in this building may be uh, practicing govern government without the consent of the governed. That's my hello guy, TV series. How are we doing? Good. Good. Paul Broder, Chief Investigator, and Rich Tracy, Investigator. How are you doing? Um, Hi. So you're for the meeting or the Correct. hearing at 10:30. Okay. Correct. Uh, I need to advise everyone that basically this is a secure facility. Mm -hmm. uh, ultimately, there are no weapons, cameras, or cell phones allowed within the secure perimeter. Okay. So if you have either of those, you can give them off to someone else if you would. And who is your counsel? You have none. All right, so you're just going in by yourself? Uh, these are all my witnesses. They are coming in with me. No, there is, this is a very small room. There is yourself, and that's it. And or you can have a, one other. How many do they get to have? <laughs> Strictly the attorney. Sharon, you can have one other person if you feel like. Anyone? Who would like to come? Lindsay. Okay. Who would you need? Lindsay. Yeah, you need. Okay, very good. Ooh, sorry. Ooh. Good luck with the gangsters. <laughs> Thank you, darling. Good morning. Hey. 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 Hey
laws of gang activity. You have to be in the gang. I don't have my cell phones apparently. Catch me down. Yeah. <laughs> that was pretty much it. It was very short and sweet. And hi, everyone. And, uh, and they asked me if I had anything to say, uh, which Lindsay was in there with me. So I turned to her and asked her, have I ever told you I was a lawyer? Why no. Have I ever represented that I'm a member of the bar? Why no. Have you ever paid me for my work? Why no. But you wanted me anyway. Yes. So uh, that's what they heard, and I told them that I had several witnesses in the lobby that would say the same thing. Uh, and uh, she declined to come out and meet everyone. <laughs> but uh, that's that's where we stand right now. That's and nice. I guess uh, if she thinks I'm still practicing law without a license, they may uh, pursue uh, an injunction to stop me from doing so. <laughs> Given so your evidence, <laughs> what led what leads her to believe that you are? What was her evidence? Uh, she, uh, the only evidence I gave her, which is the only I would have, is uh, the documents I filed on Sam's behalf, and then the documents for Lindsay, and then I did the Cynthia, uh, Cynthia Freedom Gals uh, stuff before that. But so what was the evidence that she had that that she refused, brought you to this place? She refused to name my accuser, and she refused to show me any documents that she had. So she you don't says need it's an ongoing investigation, and she'll let me know if there's anything else. So there's no longer any rule that you need to be able to face your accuser, or, uh, apparently or what is not it, discovery until, to know what the opposition? Not until there's actually a court case. This was an investigative hearing. So, <clears throat> yes, <clears throat> makes my skin crawl too. <laughs> Well, so, I, Ivy, you've uh, helped me out with the legal stuff in the past, and I very much appreciate it. These guys make it so confusing with their system, so thanks very much, Ivy. I can't tell you how much it means to have you all here. I appreciate coming out, you all coming out to support me. It's always easy to face the man when you're not alone. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely makes it easier to have everyone here. And it's good for the man to know we had that a, you're not alone. We had a, Ian tried to talk to a, a someone on camera, and, and a Dick Tracy. Dick Tracy came <laughs> down and refused to talk because Ian would not put the camera down. Are you not going to do any videotape? No. Okay. Yeah, we're still waiting we're for okay. someone who was uh, going to speak publicly, but I'd rather just leave now that you're done. Okay. All right. If, you know, Ivy. Yes. Uh, if they do go further, is this more or less that? They're going to tell you, if I come to you and ask you for advice or where to go, you might not be able to tell me. Yes. And I would have to then go and get someone Hire in their lawyer. system Correct. who is afraid of the judge. Yes, because they're they're they right. have other cases that yes. repercussions. So yes. it's a system that's, within the system. That's what they're telling so, you. Mm -hmm. So I can't ask for, well, not from you if they put that on. Correct, correct. It would be an injunction, which means and there's at least bad 24 girl, don't do of that. us here. And if I break the injunction, <laughs> it's a criminal contempt of court charge, which would hold jail time. Did they give you any impression that um, all they wanted to do at this point was leave you with the threat and really they realized they had nothing and could do nothing but they wanted to wave their guns at you anyway no i didn't get that impression i did i it was she was kind of hard to read um i did get maybe the impression that they uh, were going to proceed with some type of injunction and uh good luck to them because then i also get hurt in court and i can uh, find out have who your all of my, is. a find out who my accuser is and b have all of the people there uh, and then I get to get to call the witnesses who say, no, she never told me she was a lawyer. No, she's not. She didn't say she was a member of the bar. All those type of things, and prove my case before a judge. So, and you, know, you get to go in with more than one person. Right, yeah. and you know I've been in New Hampshire for three years, and since being in New Hampshire, I've been charged with 18 crimes, and uh, I've fa been found not guilty of all <laughs> but five, and those were speeding tickets You're just tickets becoming an annoyance to the state. You I, know I am, so um, good <laughs> luck. I'm sure I'll either win or have a lot of free time on my hands afterwards. <laughs> so, 
So there, are they preventing you now from doing anything, or is it just kind of on hold? No, it's a it's an investigation, right. so um, right, I yeah. can do whatever I guess for now. Right. You know, not which isn't much anyway. But <laughs> what are they going to do? Start an investigation? Right, right. So who needs help? Howdy. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty awesome, huh? Yeah. 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 Yeah